Hi, I'm Gail and welcome back to Low Carb Recipe Ideas. Today we're going to make mushrooms. We're just going to cook up some mushrooms that you can add on the top of your steak or you can just have them as a vegetable with the rest of your meal. They're absolutely delicious. We had them on our in between Christmas and New Year's this year and my one daughter says, oh mom, these are so delicious. So I thought, well, let's put it on because they are definitely low carb mushrooms and I think you're really going to enjoy them. So let's get started. So the first thing I'm doing is I have 18 large um, white mushrooms, which I am going to be cooking for our vegetable today. So I'm going to put a quarter cup of butter into the pan. Now I, I don't, you can do it two ways. You can throw everything in the pan all at once or you can take your your butter and you can melt your butter and then you can put in your different ingredients and then your mushrooms and cook. I just find it works just the same as if I just throw my butter in the pan. I'm going to put in a teaspoon of garlic powder. You can use fresh mushrooms if you would like. That's up to you. It's lovely being fresh also. I would put two cloves in or the garlic powder works just as nice also. So then I've got my mushrooms, my white mushrooms. There's 18 large mushrooms there. And that works out to be about 16 ounces if you're needing to the, the measurements for them. So what I'm going to do is get this going and then we're going to put the lid on it and we're going to let them start to cook. So now my, my butter is melted, my mushrooms are starting to cook in there with the garlic and the butter. One of the little tricks that I have that I absolutely love in, in my mushrooms is Nor's beef bouillon cubes. Now you take one bouillon cube and you add that and it's two carbs for the bouillon cube. So I'm just going to take it and I'm just going to kind of break it up a little. It, it will disintegrate if you just throw the block in there, but I'm just going to break it up a little, make it a little quicker. Now, when you put the lid back on, that's when you get a lot of moisture from your mushrooms. So I'm just going to stir them up a little bit, put the lid on because it creates um, steam from the lid and then you're going to get more water out of your mushrooms. So we'll just put the lid back on and we're just going to cook that for a bit. I guess I didn't really mention my temperatures. I had it turned up high just to get the butter melting and then I turned it down to medium and now I'm just kind of simmering it and if you can see the liquid in the bottom that is all from uh, the butter, the uh, bouillon cube and the moisture from the mushrooms. So I'm going to cook them with the lid on for approximately probably around 20 minutes. I'll do 20 minutes and we'll go from there to see how long I'm going to cook them this way until I take the lid off so that it can start, the moisture evaporates and then we can um, have our, our mushrooms ready to eat. So my 20 minutes is up and I've just taken the lid off and they're nice and brown and I'm going to say they are ready to be served. So we'll just turn the burner off So here are my mushrooms all ready to be served and they're delicious with steak or just as a vegetable. I think we should try one of these. They are delicious. Mm -hmm. You've got to give them a try. Go to my lowcarbrecipeideas.com Check out this recipe and my other ones. Take care and I'll see you in the next video. Bye now.